Hi guys, welcome back. Today in this video, we are going to talk about the Google Pixel Launcher and the, some of the Android or small stuff too. So already I have covered many videos in previously about the Pixel Launcher and how you can create that, how you can get that on various other smartphones running and the Android version. So just giving you a quick summarization again. So it brings a new vertical uh, app drawer feature with the new pixel icon pack, the new widget bar and the swipe feature. Now it pretty looks great. These are not the best feature, but yeah, this is fine. This brings a new concept and it is simple and great because it's never crashes. It doesn't take much memory. It's simple and good. And also it brings the new built-in wallpaper features, which does changes daily. So, so many good things are here. Now let's talk about the Android O. We have the Android O now. And the good thing is that it also comes with the Pixel Launcher. But again, that Pixel Launcher is only exclusive for the Google Pixel and the Pixel XL phones. If you install that on the Google Pixel and the Pixel XL, you're going to get that feature. Now, I, I will install that on the Nexus 6P. I still have not got that feature. But uh, you can see, I have just installed this Pixel Launcher with all the features and the swipe now features too. So this you can do that by installing the new, the latest APK for the Google Pixel Launcher. Now, also in this video, I was showing you how you can move any of your, uh, you know, applications to make a system app with get some extra features. For example, if you just install Pixel Launcher and you can make it a system app, you're going to get this swipe feature. So this is about that thing here. So I'm just going to show you demo here on my Nexus 6 head. Already I have uh, done the same stuff on my OnePlus 3 and the 3D. So important step is that to enable that as a system app feature, your device has to be rooted. Otherwise, in case you don't want to uh, get in this kind of mess up, you can just create this pixel launcher using the Nova launcher feature. I've just shown you many videos how you can do that. So all the stuffs are same except you're not going to get this Google now swipe feature and else you can do much more customization. But the widgets and all the stuff, sometimes they don't work. So I'm just telling you in case you root a device so you can get some better feature. Now how to root that, there are detailed videos I have done. Check the video description, we'll get supported links as much I will put that can help you and guide you. So. I'm assuming you have rooted your device and you need to use any of the file manager which has the root directory browsing feature. Now uh, you can optionally use Solid Explorer which is my favorite file manager of the Amulet phone. So you need to download the latest Pixel Launcher setup as you can see. It is for the 7.1.2 latest Android Pixel uh, Android source Pixel Dump. Alright, so I'll put the link, you can download that and make sure you enable this allow installation of the unknown sources once you do that. So get and install it. So install that launcher first. It should install pretty much very soon. Uh, it's my third device. I'm installing it. I've installed on my Android O, OnePlus 3 and 3T also. Make it done. Now immediately it will ask to set as a launcher. Don't set that. Use your current launcher that is set. All right. Now once you do that, you need to do important steps. First off, whenever you install an application, it goes inside the root directory. And inside the root, you have a folder called the data. Now let's check out and see where's the data folder. Mm, here's the data inside the data there's a folder called the app so it should go there and also you need to optionally um, make it sorted somewhere so you can see we have got this here com google app nexus launcher run so this is a launcher now use the dual window feature again go to the root directory and inside the root you should see a system folder and system then there is an app folder so whatever uh, app you will see here these are all the built-in system applications so all you need to do just cut it don't copy it cut it and move inside this so i'm just telling you again uh, cut this folder whichever you installed as a launcher come google android apps next launcher one inside this uh, root data app and you have to move it inside this root system applications and just see this green tick that means everything is done now once you do that after that you just have to restart your device so guys we have got our device back it's time to check whether we have got all the features or not so let it boot it's a kind of slow device still guys i really love nexus 6 you can see even on this uh, 6 inch display they have very small bezels but they are in front five speakers anyway so uh, you have to just first set the launcher again because we have not yet set it you can do the same by going inside this setting i'm just going in right tip here you just have to go either on side this apps or you can search from here home app so just select here this uh, you can see this is the pixel launcher that has came. So you have to select pixel launcher, select it. So something had will come and uh, it should work. Yeah, we got that thing here. Now compare that uh, with the, this is the official pixel launcher on the pixel phone and the Stoller Nexus 6. Uh, due to this, you know, uh, app screen size and DPI difference, you can see some bigger icons here. Otherwise, exactly same. Uh, you can see this is the 
phone dialer and the Android messaging, everything looks same. And all the Android Studio stuff, this uh, YouTube Studio Creator Studio icon. And you can going to get this here visual widgets icon. Same, it should update very soon. And we have the swipe features too, as you can see. So you are going to get almost all the features. Let's get inside. See, you get the wallpapers or not? So for the wallpapers, yeah, you got the wallpaper stuffs too. Anyway, guys, everything is done. So I'm just summarizing all the steps again. Uh, Infu device has rooted. If you want to make this launch as a system app to get this swipe feature, you have to root your device. And how to root the device? I have made a couple of videos to that may guide you. And you have to download the APK. The APK link will be also there in the description. Install it and use any of the favorite uh, file manager application which support the root browsing. Install the application and you should get that inside this root data application. You have to cut that folder and move inside this. Uh, this this is the same folder for this application just an instance nexus launcher one move inside the root system application reboot your device and set that launcher again as a default home application you should get that feature all right now in case you have any further comments and queries questions do tweet me either reach as a word i will try to help you as much as i can or you can just comment me in the same video section all right so thank you so much for watching guys hope you guys did enjoy it have a great day i will catch you very soon thank you so much